I think it was probably the most unhappy period of my life. Um, it was just very frightening because there was a lot of thrashing and um, smacking and out of control smacking, basically. And um, it, it was a scary place. I mean, you know, the nuns, the, you, there, was, there was no room for anyone to be creative or to answer, ask any questions. You got a bit of mini revenge, didn't you, when you came back to, you went back to Smethwick, didn't you? I did. I got a bit of revenge. I went, I was working, the making of Acorn Antiques with Vic, uh, with Victoria, and um, I had a day off, so I thought I'm going to go back to that school and have a look and see if there's anybody around. The school had, is no longer there, but the convent was still there, and there was this strip of grass that if you, as a if, uh, when I was a child, if we trod on it, we were summarily thrashed in front of everybody, humiliatingly, you know, around the legs. And I, got, I had these high-heeled boots on, and I walked up and... It was like harrowing it. I walked up and down, this, hoping that a nun would come. I don't know what I was going to do if they did. OK, make my day, you know, sister. Something good came out of it. This same nun, who was really frightening, um, every Friday afternoon, she started to do this thing where we had this miming game. So she said, you know, one of us had to come up and do a mime and the others had to guess what it was. It was just a simple little thing. And I kept, the first time we did it, I, she said, you'll come out. So I came out and I, I did the, I remember, remember what I did. I did this woman gossiping. I don't know what it was like. It was really awful. I don't know. But it was just gossiping to somebody else and, you know, and gossiping and laughing. And well, she, the class laughed, first of all, and she, but I heard her laugh. I heard this really terrifying woman make this big, loud sort of cracking laugh. And, and she was the one who said, you should go on the stage. She should go on the stage to the class. And, and, um, and then every Friday was, Julie, come on up now and give us one of your minds and let the others guess, you know. Was, you know. And I, that was, I, I, I felt huge power somewhere. Yeah, and a turning point that I could make her safe. This awful, frightening woman could be made into this soft, laughing person. You know, it was unbelievable.